Hello, this is Captain Scapte, and today we are playing another episode of Greg Tech New Horizons Season 2. And today we are play we are gonna do something interesting. First, I add some new machines. A basic assembler, chemical reactor, a late, and a max basic mixer. And I move to pol polarizer here. Late is actually quite useful. Uh, it's cheaper way of making bolts and uh, rods. Yeah, mixer is well, mixer mixes things for us, and a lot of uh, alloys made cheaper with it. Sampling machine is an amazing device, and we are gonna use this guy a lot. By a lot, I mean. 90% of things we're gonna do is going to be done in a sounding machine and chemical reactor it's chemical reactor and it it is it's going to be useful for a lot of stuff and mostly mostly making cheaper rubber but Today we are not going to do something electrical relate, related. We are going to make a multi-block machine. Where should I put it? Where should I put our mining and uh, ore process station? Actually, this should be then what? Okay, there, there's something wrong with the achievement system. Uh, that's one of the few first machines I crafted. Great, you're drunk. And I'm gonna remove you for now. And we will make a use for you for later. Okay. Let's make this. That should be okay. And I think I will move you. Move you. And I think it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Great, you're drunk. <laughs> ah, small coal boiler trophy. A kitchen would be a fitting place for these guys. And come to think of it, this place should be better. Yeah. Let's do. I'm here. And what we're gonna need is let's open the quest. GT plus plus. I'm gonna need this, 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 and this. What is actually this is quite simple. I just need this. And how many? Two. And low voltage fluid thingy. Actually, I know something I I will going to cook. Yes. Tumbaga. That's a strange name, but it works. Tumbaga dust. Which will require seven gold and three copper dust. I will make more than that. Okay. 14, 21, uh, Tumbaga, Tumbaga dust, 7 to 3, One, two. that should be enough, and I don't want to waste my time with macerator, so I will just use this guy, thank you, and I put well I guess yeah 
and it's going. Okay, our Tsubanga is ready and make this guy. And yes, by cheaper, we still get one to one, but we ha get half of the dust back. And let's make the steam hatch. Yes. And let's make it like this. And what we're gonna need is Vanga plates. And you come here. I'm gonna need a few more bronze plated bricks. I just realized that. So I'm gonna need for you and a lot more plates. Okay, in the meantime, let's make. So I'm gonna need tin plates too. I should have some. Yes, just need four. And poppers. Yes, I have them here. Input and input. Input, output, okay. And what we're gonna need is Steam Grinder. Which will require us two diamonds, two pistons, four more bronze plated bricks. Let's just take them. For now. And one Tsubanga frame. And which is actually quite useful. Uh, quite easy. We need program circuit 4. With our assembler. 4. And it's ready. And it should be quite easy. Let's take you guys to... Input, output, input, and front center. Okay, we're gonna need four of those guys. Whoops, and range one, two, three. I need two more plate and uh, no, four more pro plates. Steel fluid pipe. Is it small steel fluid pipe? Yes, yeah, small. <coughs> we will I upgrade it in the future, but it should be okay now. How much steam you require? It doesn't specify it. So I will assume not much. Okay. Let's connect this with wrench and then the rest of the world. This way, this way, this way, and Hemingway. Okay. Daily dose of Crofte's bad puns. And is this? And it should be okay now. Structure complete. Yes. Okay. Now, what is it? Let's get which ore should be the best for this. Now let's get brown limonite. And I'm gonna need soft metals. Yes, ore processing is ready. It will took uh, by the way, as you can see, it took eight at the time at the same time. 
Okay, that's nice. And... Yeah, it will give us 16 Crush Limonite, uh, Crush Brown Limonite at the same time. So yes, <laughs> this is a really huge thing. And it is the first step of our ore processing. And the second step is gonna require something, something bigger. Yeah, which is, by the way, let me just took this, not the steam uh, compressor, but multi-block goals. Yes, here, this guy, Steam Owen, but it's not Wilson. I should stop with it. Okay, I'm gonna need... One, two, three, four, eight in total. So I'm gonna need eight. This guy and eight, eight more plates. So I will. I have to use a lot of uh, <laughs> rods. This is gonna <laughs> take a while. This is gonna take a while, guys. And in the meantime, I also upgraded. These guys to Alumite, I should uh, have done it for a really long time ago, but I didn't. But now I did. By the way, why I'm uh, growing those? Because I need to them to finish some quests. Should I open the... Yeah, and skin. That's something. And actually, I can just turn these guys into <clears throat> this, 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 and this. To complete another quest and also extract them to turn into the. Put them somewhere. And I will make make new one when I gonna need it. I will. I'm planning to do every armor in an in an armory. So, yeah, that would be useful for the future, but not at the moment. Okay. Now, what we're gonna need? We're gonna need a lot of rough iron plates. Let's make twenty four now. That should be enough. And other than that, let's wait. By the way, guys, I will show you something really cool. Okay, with eight, I can just simply do this, and it will take forever. <laughs> and but with that, we finally have a cheaper way of furnace. Eventually. Or... Yes. And if I... Is... And I'm gonna need... Six more you. But I did that before. Oh, by the way... I forgot to get the achievements... <laughs> Uh, quest for that. Yeah, we get it. Thank you. Thank you. I will get the rewards later. With multiple goals, continue. I purchase boi boiler tank. You are actually cheaper. Also, this. This is going to require a few more roads. They are cooking. And this is full. Okay. Let's get back to you. Okay. This part is ready. So let's make one and the recipe and the 
the same time this is gonna wait for a lot of things yeah uh eight rods and this is gonna take me eight rods so by the way small note late is also a super easy way of making Last. Raw, uh, not rods, uh, screws. Casings, where did I put the casings? I should have put them somewhere. Did I make uh, less than I need? I guess so. And this one should be the last. Yes. And with that, let's make steam oven. Cool. And so you at you with you. And a wrench, thank you. And here and here and that should be enough so let's close this here and take this guy and voila we have our furnace and if i put this one here and it starts smelting let's look at it and nine at the time so yes we have a really basic ore processing queue all we need to do is one more machine but that machine can wait a bit because it's not that much needed at the moment i can manually do that but actually let me just try something can I? Uh, door. Right, I need to have water source here. Okay. Can I wash this guy? Yes. I can wash this. So, be right back. Okay, I was planning on doing... Where are you? Yeah. This guy. Uh, but... I didn't read this part. I require to have polyethylene. So yeah. Uh, this is going to be a future project. But I don't need Smasrator for now. And because I have the best Smasrator I could have. And this guy is going to get... Yeah, uh... It's gonna cover my back for a long time. Let's wait. If it's gonna automatically output to here. If not, so we might need to do something interesting. With hoppers. Oh, I forgot this part. Nuggets. No, you do not direct the outputs. So, we're gonna need hopper. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Oh, it's 8. It ate my 8. And just. I don't. Apparently, I don't need it. Uh, do I have any iron plates laying around? Tin plate, silver plate, iron plate. Okay, I'm just gonna need two more. I have to look for any I a bit better. And I need one more chest. Uh, by the way, we can make chests a lot more cheap, a lot cheaper now too. Topper. Uh, you don't need any circuits, so... 
uh, clear. It's hoppers. Iron Gear, what can I make you with? I, ho I, I believe I will find a use for you. I should stop doing things automatically. Without even thinking. But I will do. For the rest of my life. And this is going to be a curse for me. But not curse launcher. That shit is really bad. And I've got to say, in all honesty, um, it's the biggest piece of dog shit. Okay. One hopper is here. Is it going to? No. It's if I move you. Ah, yes. You will auto output. The other is going to get here. With another chest. So yes, we have an automated uh, or doubling. And can I turn you into an ingot? I should easily turn you one. It's this. Yes. And some of them have to stay but yeah we fixed our mistake actually it's not a huge mistake because this is going to give us a better yield yet but still no no not still it's copper okay you get the joke and Chalk upright, chalk upright, chalk upright, and turn into this. And we have two, uh, three steam age uh, look back, so we can turn you guys into this. Uh... Ah. Ah. And one last thing we're going to make an output. It's going to be amazing. By the way, I have a stone plate. That's one thing the wrong way Bar, come here and I think I need to cut you and okay. okay it's okay this face and yeah it's much more flushed and we can hide things easily here. Yeah, I forgot you. And with that, we have an aut semi-automated. Actually, I can just directly put on here to here. But I will automate it in a much more different way. But today, we're gonna do something else. Something magical we're gonna use our four of our circuits it's two and no one of our diamonds to enter someplace magic and also a uh, craft bunch of chests but it's gonna take a while actually i can uh, make faster but it's a bit expensive but uh, anyway, do you need any circuits? No, circuit number. And how long is this going to take? It's going to take 30 seconds. Okay, while it's you're getting ready, let's get our buckets. Or buckets. 
Okay, our four bucket is ready. And I'm gonna need a nice place to make a portal and some flowers. Luckily, bees are good with flowers. Bees are generating a lot of flowers, and let's make it day. And I happen to find the only grass patch I left in this area for my thingy. And I'm, I don't need this bamboo farm anymore, as I have bamboo crops. And this area is going to be our Twilight Forest portal. And that actually. No, uh, I'm thinking more of more like this. Okay. And it's two. Okay. Flowers. And this should be okay. Water. Water. Remember, we don't have infinite water source. And if this guy is ready, I hope it is. We will have our twilight forest. And yeah i'll just enter and leave yes quick and dirty portal generator and if i did everything correctly which i hope we will get zapped by lightning no now i what did I miss? I maybe... Okay. Two... Twelve flowers around it. Okay. I need this. Ah, yes. Twilight portal. Uh, we, and we are entering the twilight forest and... Uh, I hope it's not going to crash and burn. Uh, let's hope. We're waiting and... Yeah. I was right about to look at the server. Where do I... Why did it spawn me in here? That's a strange spawn point for Twilight Forest. Anyway. Yeah, we enter Twilight Forest. And still get you. Do you know what? I will take you because I love Silk Touch. I really love Silk Touch. And yeah, we are entering the magical age, which means I will have to find these guys. Yes, the Botania. One thing I was uh, missing from the previous uh, gameplay, and I think I'm gonna craft piston boots too. So, let's craft piston boots and end the episode for now. Okay, this guy is ready. Piston boots. Yes, we can jump higher. Which will be super useful and also we have step assist. And, strangely, this step assist is actually far more useful than the vanilla one. Crossbow body pattern. 
crossbow body pattern. It's crossbow limb pattern. Crossbow limb. Crossbow limb pattern. And what else we gonna need? Bowstring pattern. Bowstring pattern. Nice. Then we're gonna need wood. Oops. <laughs> That's quite fun, actually. And let's put you guys here and make obsidian tough bind. Wooden crossbow limb. Okay. Those two wooden and one is. String. Just take the string. And string, come here, my friend. Come here. And the string one. Okay. And so what we gonna need is putting up the crossbow itself. Yes. Completed that. And then wooden bolts. I'm gonna need to melt iron, but we will upgrade it in the future. One iron. Let's melt you. And wooden tool rod, feather fletching. Let's make some more this guy actually can i make you cheaper no i still cannot make you cheaper you are the cheap you are literally the cheapest possible way you can be that's strange also i would think fletching and feathers with bad bad feathers okay Let's make our bow string thingies and also let's put this silk touch. So I, I will have a lot of uh, thingies with me. Tool pattern. Where are you, tool pattern, my friends? Full rod pattern. And feather. Ching, thank you. And thank you. And with that, what? Ah, yes, ah, uh, yes. I need to put is put an iron into here okay and yes this is also ready and i do believe there should be a upgrade path for this guy if i remember correctly or not i have to look but what why did i done those things because i need better armor and better weapons when entering twilight forest and we will do a bit twilight forest for a while so yes we need to upgrade our weapons first and so voila, it's actually so can I upgrade you to iron chest in the assembler itself? Dark chest, trap chest. Yes, iron chest. And double iron pl plate can be easily done with this. Yeah. So 
This is Crafty, this Crafty, and... Alright. Oh, copyrights. Yeah. And have a nice day.